What is going on, folks? Welcome back to our FCS Dynasty in NCAA Football 2006. Today, we've got another doubleheader. First game is 7-4 Northern Colorado hosting the 9-1 18th-ranked Akron Zips. This should be a fun game. And the Bears are having a pretty good season. They're right in, I believe, fourth place in the Pac-10. But this should be a good matchup. I'm looking forward to it. Akron with the 19th ranked offense in the country. And Northern Colorado with the 28th. Of course, they have the number two rushing attack in the nation. Number seven defense. And that has a lot to do with that rushing attack, keeping their defense off the field. The Bears do not have a lot of star players on that defense. Just Bully Cooper and Deacon Cooper. A couple running backs out there playing linebacker. Eric Tavares is out there at middle linebacker. And double stack Rivers. The big bruising halfback. He is outside linebacker. So they've had to rely heavily on some offensive weapons to get some decent stops on defense this season. Akron, 29th ranked defense in the country. They're pretty good. Top 40 for rush defense and top 30 for pass defense. So this should be a really good matchup. I'm looking forward to it. Let's take a look at some stats for the Zips. All right. Derek Dudley. 3,200 yards passing, 31 touchdowns, and 7 picks on the season. Really good starts, uh, stats for him. Ray Smith, freshman halfback, 10 touchdowns, 817 yards. A long of 24, though, so not too many big runs from Ray Smith this season for the Zips. Leading receiver, Jacob Butler, 69 catches, 951 yards, 11 touchdowns. And on defense, led by Zach Horton, Richard sophomore at right end, 17 tackles for a loss for that young man, 8 sacks. Interception leader, Thomas Lilly, Richard Jr., strong safety. And a couple forced fumbles here for Ben Fine and Jason Blunt. Three recovered for Jordan Smith. And that is it. Kicker has missed 10 field goals, 44% on the season. And that's with an 87 kick accuracy. So I don't know what's going on with him, but he's having a rough season. They also have a true freshman punter, Leon Porter. 40-yard average, not bad. No kick returns for touchdowns. No punt returns for touchdowns either. And let's see what the Zips have done so far this season on their schedule. They only have the one loss, and that was in Week 13 against Ohio. First game, they beat Western Illinois by five. Beat Rhode Island by two touchdowns. Beat Central Michigan by five. They actually destroyed the Buffalo Bulls. That's the Bulls' only loss on the season. A 33-7 loss to Akron. My goodness. Beat New Hampshire by a couple touchdowns. Beat Wofford by 20. Beat Hofstra by three touchdowns. They beat Ball State 21-16. Lost to Ohio by a field goal. And beat Maine last week. Heading up into Greeley, Colorado for this matchup against the 7-4 Bears. All right, let's get it. You know we're going yellow. Let's do it. All right, hope you guys are excited for this one. Let me go and uh, get my phone since I left it downstairs, and I'll be right back and give out some uh, some chat shout-outs for all of you lovely sons of guns out there. Be right back. All right, let's get it, and we're kicking off first. All right, who we got in the chat? Tyler Rocky, Topsy Kretz, Resib23, Matthew Lee, Ray Senga. Let's see, who else we got here? Rocky Clearwater, Tom Schaefer in the chat. Chaos Driven, my brother. And that's it. All right. Let's do it, folks.
Darius Mitchell needs 95 yards for a 1,000-yard season. Yes, he sure does. And shout out to Double Stack Rivers. Happy birthday to that young man. We'll be seeing him play here tonight. Good pass left side, incomplete for the Zips. Alrighty, third down and 11, just like that. Let's go a little bit of nickel coverage, shall we? Dudley throws it left side. It's caught, and Jackson has the first down. So the Zips move the chains. I am prepared tonight. I have a coffee and a Dr. Pepper, so I should be all right. Hopefully I don't choke to death during the stream. You know. Ah, delicious. And nice. Oh, nice cut back from Smith. Wow. <laughs> what a cut for the first down. Having the best 18th birthday ever. That's awesome, man. Glad to hear it. Let's see if we can get you a touchdown here today. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. First down for the Zips. Inside the 25-yard line. Feels bad. I'm already sweating. Had to run up and down my stairs to get my phone. It's a little rough. I'm fat and out of shape. Whew. All right, defense. Let's step it up. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? Play action. Let me get him. No. Nice throw out to Butler, even though the quarterback was wrecked. All right, second down and one. I think I'm going to go with some 3-4 defense here. Action, left side, and Romero is going to lose a yard on the play. You remember being 18? I don't. It was so long ago. So long ago. I can't even remember yesterday, to be honest with you. Finds a big boy. <laughs> now, I don't know, weigh 190 pounds. I'm just out of shape. That's why I say I'm fat. Nice tackle. That was Eric Tavares, the halfback out there. Stopping the zip short of the marker. Bringing up fourth down and one. We got a little John going on in the field right now. Halfback to halfback. And they're going to go for it on fourth down and one with their kicker missing 10 field goals so far in the season. Zero trust in the true freshman kicker. Let's get it. Got him. What's up? Get wrecked. That's my ball. Can we get a thumbnail out of that? Oof. 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 That's rough. Sit down. Thumbnail. <laughs> wow. Got a thumbnail that quick in the game. I love it. All right. See what we can do here on offense. Jade is Streets, left side, nice block by Howard Bresnagel, and Streets breaking tackles downfield, out of bounds at the 44-yard line. Let's go. Hit that like button, absolutely. Subscribe if you're new. Join our Discord community today to get your college football career started in this here series. All right, let's see. What we, what we got here? Little play action. Man open. Oh, the referee gets in Jada Street's way. That's unfortunate. Is the EFL draft lottery going to be streamed? Uh, no, I don't think so, because it's gonna, just going to be me putting players on teams. So. And Eric Tavares gets a nice carry, picks up eight yards. Who you think is going to win the Heisman? I think Mr. Highlight is going to win the Heisman, folks. I really do. Right. 
I think Brandon Allen's going to get snubbed again. Throw it up. And almost caught, but there's flag for holding. Now, the first ever, like, actual draft in the game for the EFL, that will definitely be streamed. But the draft lottery is just me adding seniors from this series that aren't going to be in that first official draft. So I'm just creating them on the main menu and then adding them to the rosters. That's all I'm doing. Edit roster stream? Absolutely not. <laughs> Fourth down and two. You know we're going for it. You know we're going to do it. Come on, baby. And Jada Streets. Oh, inside the 20-yard line. Fourth down and two conversion. Let's go. Zoomer's speed will win the Heisman? Uh, not this year, buddy. Maybe, maybe next season. First down and 10. Inside the red zone. Double stack Rivers falling forward. Picks up eight yards on his 18th birthday. Second down and two. Darius Mitchell dropped for a couple yard loss on the play. And that'll bring up third down and four. From the 13-yard line. Tyler, you think you're going to win the Heisman Trophy next year? I like it. I like the prediction. Confidence. Aiden Davis pitches it out. Double stack. Rivers gets the first down on third and four. Got to love handing it off to the big fella. Or pitching it on that play. It's always going to fall forward. Your highlight is the GOAT. You're going to be a first overall draft pick. You very well could be the number one pick. And double stack. Stuffed. Picked up a couple yards, maybe. All right. What are we doing here? Second to go from the six-yard line. Nice nine-play, 80-yard drive. Almost two and a half minutes off the clock. Eric Tavares runs a man down. He's still going. Down to the one-yard line. Nice, powerful run for the sophomore. This has been such a fantastic drive to start the game for the Bears. Third and goal from the one just inside the one-yard line. And double stack punches it in. Touchdown on his birthday. And the Bears take the lead here in the first after a monstrous drive. And we're up to 14 viewers now on the stream. Hit that like button, folks. Subscribe if you're new. Join our Discord community today. Over 100 members right now. Get your college career started. All right, 7-0. Let's go defense. I like the way this game has gone so far. It's been very nice. Uh oh. Nope. Get him, Mitchell. Oh, <laughs> he just saved a touchdown. Oh boy. Let's go, defense. Let's go. Get out of here. That double option. Not happening, bruh. Not going to happen. Brings up second down and 11 now after the one-yard loss. Nope. Incomplete. All right. Can we get a quick three and out? That would be huge. Defense. 
Deep shot left side, and the freshman gets beat by Jackson. Huge, huge connection. Jack Marius Tactera tracks. Couldn't find the ball. And Deacon Cooper finally brings Jackson down. But he gets it all the way to the Northern Colorado 15-yard line. Final play of the first quarter here. Oh boy, get him Eric. Nice tackle for the halfback. And that is gonna end the first quarter. Seven nothing, Bears on top here in Greeley, Colorado over the number 18 Akron Zips. And we dropped all the way down to eight viewers on the stream. My goodness. And quick pass, overthrows his target. There's a third down and nine. Let's go defense. To the end zone. Oh, he got him. What a throw. Oh, my goodness. That was a beauty. Right over double sack River's hand. My goodness. That was just a perfect throw. Couldn't have been any better. Eric on defense. He thought he was on offense. He's on both right now, man. And just like that, it's all tied up after a 34-second drive for the Zips. Rez Miguel on the return from his own three-yard line. Oh, he got wrecked at the 18. Think you're going to get a Heisman? You might. You just might, man. Anybody on the Tigers in that backfield has a good shot at it. All right, Bears back on offense. And I spun the wrong way with Streets. That could have been a huge game. Just a gain of one for Streets. Rashad Farrell in the chat. What's going on, man? Nice blocking. Oh, Mitchell gets rocked. Third down and three now for the Bears. And they're running man coverage here against the triple option. Oh, nice pitch to Darius Mitchell. And Mitchell down to the 39-yard line. Nice run for the junior halfback. All right. Got <laughs> kicked off your high school team. Oh, boy. <laughs> Did it involve thick strippers? Throwing up top, Smokey Callahan can't connect. A linebacker will win the Heisman soon. Oh, buddy, bold prediction. I like it, though. I've actually won a Heisman with a middle linebacker before in superstar mode. Or Road to Glory, excuse me. I was a middle linebacker for Georgia Tech. I had like 150 solo tackles. Oh, that's an easy first down. Oh, maybe not. Great, great closing speed. I still got the first down, though. Where is that formation? There it is. All right, first down and 10 after the stats first down run. Tyler Rocky is going to be stuffed in the backfield. Nothing going on that play. All right. Double 
Double stack. On the carry, juking a man out. He's going to pick up about 10 yards. Just shy of the sticks. Third down and one. Charles Woodson is your all-time favorite player. Yeah, he was real nice. Real nice in college and the pros. Wow. What a play. Oh, my goodness. Mitchell gets absolutely lit up by the left end. But you know we're going for it. You know we are. It's got to be done. You're more of a Walter Payton guy. I love me some sweetness, man. Always go back and watch his highlights. He's just too good. Take off, Darrell. Nice block by Smokey Callahan. And stats inside the red zone. Great block by the tight end down there to get stats an extra 15 yards down the sideline. Another great drive for the Bears. Oh boy. They're getting some pressure on the right side of this offensive line. It's that non-subscriber right guard. That's unfortunate. Aggressive play calling. <laughs> you bet your bottom. Going up against the top 20 team in the country. Got to play aggressive. Double stack Rivers up the middle. And gets all those yards back and then some. Making it third down and three. Very manageable here for the Bears. All right, Tom, hurry back, buddy. Oh, boy. That was rough. I guess we're kicking the field goal this time. Johnny Ligurski, freshman kicker, coming on for the attempt. He's been pretty darn good for them this season. Kick is up, and it is good from the freshman. And we take the lead. 13 plays, 63 yard drive. Took almost four minutes off the clock. Wow. That's how they have such a good defense. They're not on the field most of the time. 99 kick power from Ligurski. Gets it to the goal line. Uh-oh. Oh, that's not good. Get him, Jada. Got him. <laughs> oh, save the touchdown. Wow. That was unfortunate. All right, hopefully our defense can step up here and hold them to a field goal now after Shreet saved the touchdown. Oh, how did I not deflect that pass? Oh, boy. Wow. That's unfortunate. That was some pretty great coverage, too. Feels bad. What week are we in? We're in uh, week 15 right now. It's the final regular season week of the season. All right, so we're down 14-10 now. Need a quick drive here. Get some more points on the board before the half is over. We do get the ball to start the third quarter. Mitchell in the backfield behind Stats. He'll get the 
carry left side brought down after about a six yard carry Davis in a quarterback, he's sacked immediately. Oh boy. Who do I think is the best running back to not win a Super Bowl? Uh, Barry Sanders. That's a very easy choice for me. That's not how I wanted that drop to go. Okay, that was very quick three and out. Wagurski on for the punt. And he gets a pretty decent one to midfield. First down of 10 for the 18th ranked Zips. Oh boy. That was a perfect throw. Rivers almost had the deflection on that one. So close. So, so close. Deep shot. How did I not pick that? Come on now. That's rough. That's perfect coverage. Man. Akron looking dangerous right now. Throw it backwards to Jackson. And he's going to be brought down at the 8-yard line. And they're going to continue to go no huddle here. Oh, what a play. Oh, man. Tavares did all he could. What a great catch by the receiver. Man. Quarterback throwing darts out here. And just like that, Akron on top. About to be 21 to 10. Man. Twenty-one to ten with thirty-six seconds left here in the first half. Bears having a rough second quarter. Where is this play from Akron in real life? <laughs> yeah, they're not very good. Not very good at all. All right, let's get it. Play action. Oh, man. Callahan had him beat. All right. Now I'm upset. Where's my head at? Pfft, man, I don't know. <laughs> it's just been a rough second quarter, man. Oh, my goodness. I can't do anything with pressure up the middle like that. Look at that, that was just instant. I don't care how fast Darrell's stats is, there's no way he's outrunning that. Wow. Terrible second quarter from the Bears. Wow. Oh my goodness. 
Oh boy. Jarmel Lewis in the chat. What's going on, brother? Ligurski gets off a booming punt. And we bring Gordon down. And that's going to be the end of the first half. Number 18, Akron on top, 21 to 10 here in Greeley, Colorado, over the 7 and 4 Northern Colorado Bears. We do get the ball to start the third. Not a chance. Akron has way too much speed. They had two great drives. That was it. Double stack. Picks up a few yards off the left side. Put the backup quarterback in. <laughs> what? What's that going to do? He does have a couple formations that he's in. So it's not like he doesn't see the field. Put the backup defense in. If only they had one. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Akron is hungry. They're just getting so much pressure up the middle. And that's not good because Northern Colorado's strong suit is that offensive line. <laughs> I just took that first sip of Dr. Pepper. That's right. All right, let's go. Oh, boy. Quick pass. Jada Streets. Jada Streets. Oh, inside the 30-yard line. The playmaker. I love that speed. Just outrunning that corner. Almost got past the safety. Someone block Akron's monster defense? I wish they could, man. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oof. Stats was hit as he threw. And that pass was very inaccurate. Gavin Brady, Scott, um, yeah, Smokey Callahan are in the zone right now. Here's Tyler Rocky with a nice juke, and he's going to pick up the first down for the Bears. Their corners look slow. They are slow, but our receivers are even slower. All right, what do we got here? Oh, boy. Look at this, folks. Ron Durrell. Oh, boy. Just lost about 12 yards on the sack. Offensive line is getting destroyed right now. Man, oh, man. Second down, 23 now after the 13-yard loss on the sack. And Smokey Callahan was wide open and dropped it. Wow. Okay. Stats 2 of 8, but 78 yards. And that's all to Jada Streets right now. Chug it up. Why not? Howard Bresnagale got laid out in the end zone. Man. Going to have to attempt, attempt a field goal here with Johnny Ligurski. He's got a pretty good leg. It's a 47-yard attempt, though, for the freshman. Cut. 
I missed. Good lord. Oh, man. I don't want to talk about it, guys. We need a big play on defense. That's the only way we're going to come back and win it. Sit down. Just going to keep blitzing. Whatever. Why not? Pass is incomplete. Third down and ten, just like that, and I'm gonna blitz again. Defense, 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 defense. Go defense. All right, let's go. We got the stop. Now, if only our offensive line could block just a little bit so I can get that ground game working. Man. All right, we're at our own 26-yard line. 3.39 to go in the third. Jada Street's in the backfield. And zero blocking. Wow. Come on. You saw the UCLA bear. Yeah, it's the only mascot that, you know, makes any sense for Northern Colorado. Double stack rivers. Nice carry. Nice blocking downfield. Picks up the first down. Let's go. 53 yards. For the freshman. <laughs> Don't blame Tavares. He's playing good. Oh my goodness. The offensive line, however, is not. Oh boy. Got the box just stacked right now. Tyler Rocky in the open field. Look out! The young freshman! Can he win the foot race? No, he can't. Down at the one. Oh, what a run for Tyler Rocky. Almost broke it all the way. Man, so close. hard for that run. First and goal from the two-yard line. Double stack is dropped at the line of scrimmage. Double Stack's going to punch this one in. His second touchdown of the ball game. And Northern Colorado closes the gap now. One score, ball game again. Touchdown set up by Tyler Rocky. Drive finished off by Double Stack Rivers. Six plays, 74 yard drive. Minute 38 off the clock for the Bears. And we got ourselves a ball game again. Just tackle. <laughs> you don't want to win, put booby in. Friday Night Lights, man, that's a classic. 
Got that on Blu-ray. False start on the offense. That's what I like to see. For the other team, of course. Making it a good one. Yeah, man, I'm trying. Akron's a tough squad. Good pass left side. Falk is wrecked. Ace White laid him out. Second down to 14 now. scared. He heard Bully Cooper running towards him. Alright, third down and 14. I'm going to blitz Eric Taveras up the middle here in that middle linebacker spot. We pass left side. Great play by Jack Marius. Tech there tracks the freshman corner. Let's go. Fourth down, baby. Darius Mitchell, junior halfback, on for the return. And spins and jukes. Jukes again up to the 48. And there's a flag for clipping. Goat. They're not going to make it easy for us to come back and win it, huh? They just have immediate pressure. It's insane how fast they get in the backfield. Tavares still picks up a yard on the play somehow. Heard that name on Key and Peel? <laughs> you sure did, man. It's a good name. I like it. I can pronounce it. It's all good. All right, stats. Get loose. Oh, good tackle by number 17. Okay. Third down and five. Who wants it? Who wants it? Just gonna have to take off. And hey, nice block and stats picks up the first. Let's go. Whew. That was close. That was real close. Third quarter winding down. Oh boy. Uh oh. That's not good. Aiden Davis will come in for all the snaps now at quarterback. True freshman guy. Played quite a bit this season in several formations. And it's now second down and 19. Deep pass overthrown intended for Morris. Oh boy. Feet double stack? I would if it wasn't second down and 19 and then third and 19. Trust me. I'd love to be running the football right now. Alright. Let's get it. One-on-one -on -one coverage. There's holding on the play anyway. And that was on Heath, the left tackle. Or the right tackle, excuse me. Oh, boy. No, that was a left tackle. I know what I'm talking about sometimes. All right. No need to panic. Still a one-score game. 
Ligurski on for the punt. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. Inside the 20-yard line. And uh-oh. Oh, we got lucky he ran out of bounds. All right. Let's get it. Halfback pass. Get out of here. This is why you like to run man coverage. They're all stats out for the game with a sprained elbow. So Aiden Davis takes the reins for the rest of the game. Can he lead a fourth quarter comeback? Oh, hey, get your fours up, folks. I forgot to say it. Uh-oh, deep pass. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, I almost had a heart attack right there. Wow. Third down and 17 now. Woo. He pass over the middle. Deflected away, and we get another stop. Let's go. This is like the Dayton game the other night. Got me on the edge of my seat. And let's see. That's a nice kick to the sideline. Darius Mitchell has it. On up to the left sideline. Pushed out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Let's go try to get this ground game working. They've just been getting so much pressure. Like right on the snap. It's been hard to get anything going. Got a couple of nice runs, though. Double stack. Tries to cut it back left side. Picks up three yards. He's got 58 yards on the day. Two scores. Right. Gavin Brady, fullback, is in the zone. Hopefully he can lay a good block here for Tyler Rocky, who is stuffed at the line of scrimmage. That play was blown up. Man. Poor Tyler. He's had one good run. Oh, maybe two. All right. Third down and seven. We are five of 12 tonight. Aiden Davis throws it up. Oh, can't get it to Bresnagale. Man, they're going to make our defense win this game. Trying to Ligurski on for the punt. Oh, boy. And that's going to go into the end zone for the touchback. Oh, man. I've been running like the same five or six plays on defense so far this whole game. Get out of here. Need better fat dudes to block. This is the best offensive line we have on all 12 of our subscriber schools. Akron is just getting, a, <laughs> getting some great pressure. Double option. Oh, how did I not hit that? Come on now. Come on, then. Another third down. Third and five. Good pass left side incomplete. The defense gets another stop. Oh, boy. Can't keep relying on the defense, though. I'm out of Dr. Pepper, and I'm sad. All right, Darius Mitchell on for the return. Oh, no! Oh, oh no! Darius! What are you doing, my guy? Oh, boy. 
Oh boy. Oh, that's unfortunate. Man didn't even get tackled and he fumbled it, bruh. Oh, great play action. Oh no. No. Feels bad. Can't come back. This will be two years in a row that Akron beats Northern Colorado. How you gonna blame me for that fumble? Come on, cheeseburger. 28-17. Still got 349 left in the game. Oh, man. All right. Plenty of time left, guys. Plenty of time left. They are just stacking the box every drive, though. Double stack. Still going. Picks up six yards. He's exhausted. I'm not giving it off to Darius Mitchell so he can fumble for a third time today. Should have ran out of bounds on a punt return. Come on, my guy. Not going to happen. Can I get a block, though? Can I get a block? Look at that time of possession. And we got 17 points to show for it. Bro. This is a little rough. I'm a little upset about it. Down to five. Yeah, big dog, big dog. Loud right. Three, six, three inside four. All right. Big dog, big dog. Cut. Third down to five. Deep shot. Jada Streets. Oh, it hit him in the head. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, boy. Fourth down and five. Wow. I didn't even throw it to him, but good catch from Morris. Oh boy. Oh, that was almost disastrous. Wow. Whew. This is rough, guys. I can't even lie to you. One on one, Bres Miguel. He's got it inside the 20. <laughs> Let's go. You know we're going no huddle. Let's go. Oh, no. He had him. <laughs> no. Oh, boy. Double stack on the carry. No blocking, of course. Of course. Why not? Not focused. Oh, I'm focused, all right. It's just a rough game right now, that's all. Who wants it? Throw it up. Jada Streets can't come down with it. And we're going to have to kick a field goal here. With Johnny Ligurski. 34-yard attempt for the freshman. Yeah. 
Kick is up, and it is good. It's 28-20. Back to a one-score game. And we're going to kick it deep. When was the last time UNC wore blue? <laughs> I can't remember. I just went yellow because Akron has a little bit of blue on their uniforms. Oh, that was clipping, but okay. Good tackle. We got three timeouts left. Get him. Nice tackle for Ace White. I don't want to call a timeout yet. First down and more. Get him, double stack. Oh, how is that not clipping? What? What? <laughs> oh, my goodness. How is that not clipping on double stack? Bruh. Bruh. Are you for real? My guy. What is that? Look at the line I had on him. I had him dead to rights. Oh my goodness. That is some BS if I ever saw it before. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I cannot believe that. Longest run of the season for that halfback. Wow. That's some straight up foolery right there. Unbelievable. I can't believe they didn't call that. <laughs> That's unreal. Actually unreal. Run, Howard. You're so slow. Oh boy. That was insane. I I just, I don't know what to say. I, I don't know. I don't know. Get it, Jada. Get it. Yeah, what's up? We still in it, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Noah Regier in the chat. What's going on, brother? Huge touchdown pass from Aiden Davis the Jada Streets. Let's go. We back in it, baby. Three timeouts left still. I don't feel like going for two right now, so I'm going to kick that field goal. Whew. Yeah. 35-27. Back to a one-score game with 50 seconds left. I'm going to kick it deep again because we do have three timeouts. I didn't burn any on that last drive. I swear if I get clipped again, though, I, I will rage. I will. <laughs> Jada Streets, player of the game for the Bears. Dudley, player of the game for the Zips. No balls, what you mean, man? I wanted to keep it a one-score game. Can we tackle him, please? That's rough. Oh, boy. One first down should end it. And they got it. Dang it. Really? 
Really? Wow. I didn't know we were going up against Barry Sanders. Unbelievable. Oh boy. This has been a crazy game. Stick around for our second game of our doubleheader, number uh, 10, Southern Utah. We'll be taking on. Who are they taking on? Can't remember. One second. <laughs> Southern Utah at Idaho. All right. Oh, there's always hope, Noah. There's always hope, buddy. They're cheating their safety up, so they're not going to have any safety help deep. Jada Streets is wide open. And he's got another one. Inside the 10-yard line. Wow. <laughs> no way. That was crazy. Oh, we throw the pick. That's unfortunate. Oh, there was offsides. Okay. I'll take that. That's crazy. Howard Bresnigan on the back for the touchdown. Oh boy. Got to get this and then an onside kick. Dart. <laughs> oh man. That was insane. What a laser beam. Johnny Ligurski on for the two point conversion. We got it. <laughs> we got it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, buddy. I want to say that line from Waterboy, but I'm not gonna. Woo! <laughs> oh, man. Let's go. Oh, we dropped it. Six seconds left. We got one timeout left. We don't need it all on one play. They got one-on-one -on -one coverage here with Howard Bresnigal. Oh, man. Dang. <laughs> oh, they doubled Jada on the right. Oh, man. Dang, we fall short at home to the 18th ranked Akron Zips, but what a finish, folks.
Jay Washington in the chat. Man, we got the onside kick. 12 seconds left. Fell just short of the comeback. But holy moly, what a game. <laughs> oh, man. Slap that like button if you haven't already. Stick around for our second game of our doubleheader. Number 10, Southern Utah at the Idaho Vandals. My goodness. What an absolutely insane game. Bad play calls. Ray, why do you hurt me so bad? Those plays at the end is what we were scoring on. Seven times we got sacked. The offensive line was like paper mache. Oh, boy. Dominated time of possession. Why are you guys so hurtful to me all the time? <laughs> Saying I choked it away, bad play calling. You guys are nuts. <laughs> I got 12 seconds left, one time out. What am I supposed to do there? I just got to chuck it deep. Boy, oh boy. Double stack, two touchdowns on his birthday. Couldn't get the dub. But he had himself a pretty good game. Man. We're definitely going to schedule Akron again for Northern Colorado. Four catches, 219 yards on a touchdown for Jada Streets. And four drops for the receiving core. Great. Will Jefferson allows four sacks today. <laughs> what? Oh, man. That's terrible. Bully Cooper, seven tackles, two for loss. Deacon Cooper only had two tackles. Tough love. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> man, it feels bad. I, I really I had so much hope after we recovered that onside kick. I actually jumped out of my seat when we got that. Johnny Ligurski recovering his own onside kick. That's nuts. <laughs> he did pretty good punting as well. 47-yard average. And Darius Mitchell with a couple fumbles here tonight. Unfortunate. Now, I'm going to be starting our second stream... Uh, right after I end this one, I'm just going to have to run downstairs and get a water. But, I hope you guys enjoyed that absolutely insane game. I'll see you guys in maybe like five minutes-ish with number 10 Southern Utah. 10-1 and one on the season at the 3-8 and eight Idaho Vandals. I'll see you guys very shortly. Take it easy, guys. Kobe!